Hi, boys and girls. Guess who I'm here with? My favourite little guy, Dopey. Dopey's been working so hard with his writing. And before you came along, he was telling me about his mum. And he wrote a sentence about her. Let's have a look and see. Dopey wrote, my mum is the best mum in the world. Your mum, Dopey. I thought my mum was the best mum in the world. What do you think? Hmm. Well, let's see if you wrote a good sentence, Dopey. We're using the five stars of writing to make sure we write great sentences. Has Dopey used neat handwriting? Well, all these letters look beautiful to me. And they're all in the right places in the sky and the grass. Well done, Dopey. High five. Yes. Okay. Has he used a capital letter to start his sentence? Oh, Dopey, you forgot your capital M. It goes high in the sky and has pointy bits to show that it's a capital M. Let's check there's no other cap. Oh, Dopey, what's that? Oh, he says the always has a capital. No, Dopey, only when it's the first word in a sentence. When the word the is in the middle of a sentence, it's a small lowercase t. Okay, not a tall one. Let's keep checking, let's keep checking. Dopey! He just said that I told him that I was always a capital. I think you're remembering part of it, Dopey. I is a capital when it's by itself. I like, I eat. But when it's in a word just like is, we use the small i. A small i. Okay, good try, Dopey. We're learning still. Has he used finger spaces between his words? Yes, yes, yes. Dopey, that's one word. When we write a word, the letters go together because they're all friends. So mum should be M-U-M with the letters close together like friends. That's okay, Dopey. We're still learning. Great finger spaces between your other words. Fantastic. Good work. Has he used punctuation to end his sentence? Dopey, you forgot your punctuation. I don't know it's finished unless you put something at the end of the sentence. Let's see. My mum is the best mum in the whole world. Wow. Hmm. Is Dopey asking a question? No, he's telling us something. So, should we put a full stop? My mum's the best mum in the world. We could, but Dopey's actually saying my mum's the best mum in the whole world. Because he's telling us something that's really special and wow, we can use an exclamation mark. My mum is the best mum in the world. Yay. Good for you, Dopey. Well, let's try and write this sentence again using the five stars of writing. Are we ready? Capital M to start, Dopey. Nice and tall, which means the Y has to start down here on the grass and go down into the dirt. Now, when I write the word mum, I'm keeping my letters close together because the letters inside a word are all friends. There's my finger space for the word is. Now, the in the middle of a word has a small t. The best mum. Now, when I write the next word in, I'm going to use a small i, Dopey. The next word is the and the last word, world. And instead of just putting a full stop, my mum is the best mum in the world, we want to say it like this. My mum is the best mum in the world. Great work today, Dopey. Even though it's my mum who's the best in the world. Okay, now it's your turn to fix Dopey's next sentence. Say bye, Dopey.